Welcome back everyone. I hope you're doing well. Thanks for joining me for this episode of Mars Anomalies. We'll be having a look at some strange artifacts I found near Zurong Lander in Utopia Planitia and it's located right there in the middle of nowhere between the Mars 2020 mission and the Curiosity Rover and Insight Lander. We'll have a look at that terrain and some of the anomalies close by and it's also not too far from the nuclear explosion that occurred on Mars in the distant past. A second look at Zurong Lander, that's what the high-rise team calls this JP2 photograph. It was acquired on the 11th of June 2021 at 29 centimeters per pixel. I'll be showing you images dropped from the JP2 black and white map projected file, just over 900 megabytes in size, as well as images cropped from the merged RGB color strip. In this low res black and white, we can make out the lander right there, folks, and the Arava a little to the south. So the site we're looking at is located at 25 degrees, 18 minutes north, 109 degrees 53 minutes east. There's the Mars 2020 rover at the Jezero Delta. Over here to the east we have the Curiosity rover and the InSight lander. And the nuclear explosion occurred over there to the top right, folks. I'd say about a thousand kilometers to the east of this site. So there's a lot going on in the northern mid latitudes of Mars. All these rovers and landers, I wonder what these guys are after. We'll have a look at some of the anomalies which might give us a clue. Yeah, we can make out the parachute and part of the landing gear. We take a close up look, we can see the folds in the chute and part of the landing craft over there to the left. This is an incredible JP2 photograph, folks. Yeah, we're looking at the lander and see tracks leading up to the little rover right there, guys. There's a look at the lander up close. We make out quite a couple of details on it. I don't see the, the ramp though. Could it be over there? Not quite sure. And there's the little rover up close. You can see the tracks behind it right there. We're looking at another part of the landing gear. This is in the black and white part of the photograph. We can make out the symmetry and geometry of the equipment right there folks and there's a look at the pieces of equipment of this Zurong mission. Yeah we're looking at strange structured items folks lots of right angles to these anomalies. Joe from Art Alien TV a while ago also featured some others that he found in a previous photograph so let's have a look at this close up you can see outlines of what looks like a buried structure over here lots of right angles guys this piece over here for example is about 15 meters long so we're looking at foundations or walls of an ancient structure here covered in sand here we're looking at more rectangular shapes in the surface, guys. This one over here is about 15 meters long as well. You can see two of them there. Next one, another rectangular part inside it. And there's another rectangular piece over here to the bottom right. Strange hollowed out areas. Or could these be walls or foundations of an old structure? 
we're looking at four similar features over there next to each other in a square pattern folks each one of these is about 10 meters in length look at the perfect symmetry and geometry in that looks almost like a Microsoft Windows logo it's got the same shape and there they are for you to compare could be natural but folks check out the geometry and symmetry in this piece and we're looking at square hollowed out areas this over here is about 12 to 15 meters across it's got right angles to it parallel edges as well and there's another anomaly like it this one over here on the side is about 18 to 20 meters long check out the right angles again folks parallel edges the long side on this one is about 12 to 14 meters long looks like recent activity as well also right angles and parallel edges to this one also blocky items close by strange disc shaped anomaly over there to the right and there they are side by side for comparison and they look very very similar to others that are recently featured in connections edition strange surface features north of Elysium Planitia on Mars and there's a huge one folks each side of here has about 30 to 40 meters in length right so we have a Zurong lander right there let's look at the anomalies are featured just for summary the 2020 mission in Jezero where we have these strange canals possibly outlines of ancient structures also rectangular surface features And then over here we have the Curiosity rover. Check that out folks. It looks like it's on top of an ancient structure. Lots of right angles in these anomalies as well folks. More hollowed out areas. Looks like the outlines of buildings. Check out those similar square shapes in a row. And then the inside lander that photographed more of these megalithic type blocks that I've discovered all over Mars. So let's have a look at what's near the site where that nuclear explosion happened strange standing monolith with a strange part carved into it it looks almost like an eye and it's got three sides to it this piece is about 15 meters long guys Let's see what we have up here to the north strange parts again blocky items check out those two are cut to fit together small hole in that one right there in its center the customary knob or smaller object in the center of that one check out this piece very weird just of two large parts there's a gap between them and a small bridging part in the center and that's a recurring design 
that I've found all over Mars do check out those blocks in a row there guys L shaped piece highly artificial looking there weird stuff going on there hollowed out part it's got that small object in that hollowed out area lots of these uh, small blocks looks like that's been arranged almost like a stone hinge let's have a look at these weird parts have you uh, parallel with one another check out that bridging part there seems to be attached at a right angle to this piece and then more blocks I've seen this quite often on Mars too where we have a block and in the center on the one side we have a small protrusion or knob and that's it for this one thank you for watching give it a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed it and let's have a chat in the comments i'd love to hear what you think of these to my new subs welcome on board thanks for joining the channel and to those of you that haven't subbed yet and uh, you like my work and research why not consider hitting the subscribe button clicking the bell and the option all that way you'll know when i upload my next one until the next video take care i'll see you then cheers for now